you are here because you have seen the imminent destruction of the United States of America as we know it. It began with COVID. It began with fear. We were forced into lockdown. No work, no school, no social interactions. The only form of communication was social media and mainstream media, both of which are compromised. Then the stimulus checks were sent out to quell us, to keep us calm. Then tracking and tracing was implemented. Then riots began. Then the defunding of our law enforcement. Then the systematic destruction of our historical monuments. This is no longer about a virus. This is about control. This is about the destruction of the Constitutional Republic our forefathers fought and died for 244 years ago. They want us to keep the fight on social media where they control the narrative. They want us in our homes, muzzled with masks, arguing with our friends over what happens next. They want us afraid. They want us to feel helpless. They want us to wait until the fight comes to our homes, our house, so that one at a time, they can slowly pick us apart. They want to make an example of us and do it while we're not organized, while we're not in great numbers or in masses. This is not about a virus. This is about division. This is about taking away our freedoms one at a time, slowly, so that by the time we recognize what's happening, it is too late. You are witnessing the destruction of the Republic and the installation of socialism and communism. But you are here because you've seen this all coming. You are here because you have a voice that has not been heard. You are here because you are the lifeblood of this great nation. We are the silent majority. And we are done being silent. For massive change to occur, massive action must be taken. I want you to remember this. It comes straight from our Declaration of Independence. That whenever any form of government becomes destructive of these ends, it is the right of the people to alter or to abolish it. It is their right, it is their duty, to throw off such government and to provide new guards for their future security. This fight is in your hands. The success of this mission is in your hands. Nothing like this has ever been done before. And I'll say it again. We are the silent majority. We are limitless. We will succeed. This is our country, and we are taking it back. Patriots, this is your call.